buy new non-busted webcam. <laughs> All right, let's <laughs> let's keep going. I think we're recording, right? Okay, we're recording. The controller's working. Everything's working. We're good. Okay, so No Rest for the Wicked is clearly related to killing all of the developers, but we're missing one developer, and I don't know where he or she is. We killed the guy who was picking strawberries, right? Let's go over this again. We killed... We killed the guy all the way on the left side of the map, past the shopkeeper district. We killed... Oh, who else did we kill? That's a dark thought. We killed... We I know we killed the guy down here, in the waterfall place. We killed the music man. And we killed Strawberry Man. Who else? Like, we didn't run into any others, did we? Is he... is he hiding? We have a one of the developers is hiding somewhere. He knows soon. That's a good question. Maybe we should check over here. Have we checked this yet? Oh, wait. What's this? Okay. Well, a hint is never bad. Is this? Are we gonna find him? No. Oh, okay. Well, that was less exciting than I thought it was gonna be. Ah, we can't go back. Okay, well, we found a hint. That's something, at least. I don't think there's anything else useful, though. I didn't want a hint, though. I wanted to go kidnap the princess and stuff her in a box. You heard me. Okay. What if it's a giant mimic? The whole treasure chest is a mimic. So we're gonna go over here and grab the hook claw because we have to have it in order to rescue the princess in any considerable capacity. We're gonna wait because that little mimic or not mimic, the little minion is going to be there. We're going to have to get creative to search for the last producer, developer. We've explored, clearly we've explored the majority of the map, right? I feel like there's very few places or secrets or things that we haven't seen yet. I think we're good on that front. It's just... We need to... Oh, I should have taken the, the mirror shortcut. I don't know why I didn't. But yeah, again, we're probably going to have to get a little bit creative in where we're checking for the last developer. They seem to be spaced out fairly well, so I wouldn't suspect we find, like, another one in the waterfall. I wouldn't suspect we find another one near the shopkeeper or on Macro Mountain. I was expecting to find one in the desert, to be honest. Or hoping might be a better word. There's also that cage on the map. It keeps telling us that cage is there, like there's something we're supposed to do with it. I mean, I suppose one of the developers could be in that cage. How how would we get him or her down? I mean, what are our options? We could try to cut it with a sword? We could try and rock it back and forth? I'm not rightly sure. Come on, princess. Okay. We'll take her to the box. Maybe that'll be something new. I don't know. I'm kind of lost as to how to make the box close.
Is this the wrong way? This is the wrong way. Guess we don't need to do that. We're only carrying the hook claw. I also really wish I knew what the gusts of wind were for over there, but whatever. Okay. Oh, it's a broken... The hourglass is broken, so you can't rewind when you have the princess. I think that's what that is. Now... I don't know what the Beauty and the Beast is. I might- maybe we have to go kill the- Oh, it is closed now. Okay. Oh! This treasure wasn't here before. Let's find out- <sighs> Well, I did say it might be a giant mimic, right? I think I moved my... ...laptop there. Of course. Those mimics knew that Tim was sexually attracted to big chests and took advantage of it. After eating him, the mimic laid eggs inside of Tim's house. This is the story of one of those mimic spots. <laughs> oh my gosh! It's adorable! It's a tiny, like, skull ghost with little blonde hair. What, wait, how is our name still Tim? We're we're still Tim. Oh well, that's that's fine. That's that's good enough. Okay. I love this. Uh Alright, well let's go grab the princess again and take her to the dragon. At least we finally solved the mystery of how to how to get the treasure chest to close. I guess we could just get hit by this minion, but I'm too stubborn to. Okay, so from here we do... Wait. From here we just go straight into the... Into the mirror. It really shouldn't be an issue to take the princess... Um... To the dragon, right? There's nothing really stopping us. The dragon is pretty much accessible right from the beginning of the game, as long as you're not carrying too many items to climb the mountain. We can't take the mirror back, but that's not a problem. We wouldn't want to. It would deposit us right into the castle, which would probably give us an ending that we don't want. Okay, so... Dragon, and that's it? I don't really foresee any big issues here. Guess it's just the long journey to the dragon. You can barely see the princess. We have so much, so many pixels going on here. Admittedly, it's probably more comfortable for her to ride on the back of this thing. Oh no, we fell. I don't think it matters. We just don't want to go to the barn, but I don't think we can go to the barn anyway, because we don't have any... We don't have the sword. Okay. We are carrying a single item, though. Is that going to make it too hard to get out? No, because we can just hook claw back. Okay. Yeah, we're good now. Sweet. 
I'm assuming that's what Beauty and Beast means. I mean, if not, then congratulations, we went all this way for nothing! That <laughs> was so close! Uh, I might have lost it if I fell in the lava there. Alright, dragon, here's the princess. Take her. As the dragon and the princess saw each other, they knew they were meant to be together. They slowly approached each other, becoming one. Through digestion. And I see we lost the webcam again. First date. Ending 92. Leave it to a mimic spawn to uh, transport a princess to a dragon. Tim was arrested for feeding the animals and released days later. He was lucky they didn't find out what kind of food he used. Well, okay. How many more endings do we have? We only have six more endings. And... As far as the hints go, we don't have access to... Any endings that don't involve either, I'm assuming, collecting all the crystals, or... Let's go take a look at that... At that, um... Cage. The one that I have no clue what it does. Or we can just accidentally get shot out of a cannon, that's fine too. I'm just gonna skip the compass and the... The compass on the map, I don't see a point. Okay. So hopefully we can just rock this cage back and forth? I'm guessing? It's been on our map since we gained access to the map and I've never done anything with it. So it says think carefully before you step on these, but what? So rocking back and forth does nothing. Think twice before jumping on these platforms. But why? I don't understand. Well, now we can't get back up here, but... But that's not a big surprise. Okay, what what do you do with a cage that just floats? Do you... Wait a minute. The answer to all the other endings has been take the princess to it. So let's take the princess to the cage. I might have to look up where the last dev is. We'll do, we'll do like a big sweep of the of the kingdom at some point. If we don't find him, then I will. Okay, so we don't have the hook claw because I'm an idiot. Also, we should just take the shortcut because why not, right? Stupid minion. Oh no. Oh wait, we're good. I just want to go down here anyway. Okay, rescue the princess, take her to the cage. Take her to the cage. And then we will have the princess in another castle. Maybe.
Otherwise, we just picked up the princess for basically no reason. We can't sacrifice the princess, can we? Have we killed the princess? Probably. It feels like something we would have done a while ago. I just realized I don't really remember where the cage is. I think we need to go up, like, a lot. Especially after I fell there. Fell down that, uh... Waterfall. Okay, we should be able to go this way and get out of the well. And from the well, we should be able to get up to the... Cage. Yes, the minion has caught all the piranhas. So what happens if you take the bombs? Does that minion not die? You would assume he doesn't. Please, not another cannon. Wait, this is the wrong way. Oh man, you can't, can't do it, there's nothing here. What is the point of this? This is clearly a cage, right? It's swinging back and forth. Wait, did we just fall into it? Wait, what? Ugh. I don't know. Let's go up Macro Mountain. Are you listening? <laughs> she at least seems to have, okay, I guess. Wait, what'd she say? It's freezing up here. It probably is. I guess this will be a good way to double check, make sure we killed Strawberry Boy. Yeah, he's dead. But we can't jump up. Who was that guy? This makes no sense. Are you taking me back to the Dark Fortress? Yeah, I think we are. I mean, it doesn't make a lot of sense to me either. I saw that stupid video of you jumping off this cliff. Please don't do it again. Don't. <laughs> well, there's all this wind. We can fly. So this is how we get into the wind. I mean... Okay. But... What was the point of this? Well, uh, uh... Okay, we solved the mystery of how to get... ...back into the castle. Congratulations, us. It didn't solve anything... ...in regards to, uh... ...the ending we needed. No rest for the wicked. There's just nothing up- nothing else up here. Please don't jump off the balcony. I really hope you have a good escape plan. Well, we're back full circle, I guess. Hmm. I suppose we can just drop. Ah! It's Javi! We found him! One of the creators of this world, I'm here looking for financing. Javi, we will be back for you, my friend. We will be back for you. The real question is, 
Where do we go now? I guess we get on here. What's this all about? Oh. Oh. Okay. Javi, we'll be back. We just have to go get our equipment. That's something. Something, something, equipment. Totally not sinister in any way. Can we get up here? No, that's a, that's a, that's a nothing up there. Oh no, but now that we're down here, do we have to fight the Dark Lord? Please don't rescue the princess while we're away. It's okay. We're ready to grab Javi. I think we ran into that guy before. Do you really think it's a good idea to leave through the- We're not leaving through the front door. We're just taking you sightseeing. It's fine. Don't worry about it. You have a bad feeling. Your triggers are being triggered backwards. Okay, so if we want the sword, what do we need to do? We need to make it back to Tim's house. I think we can do that. And we can take the mirror back. We don't immediately trigger the ending if we take the princess to the top of the castle, do we? Shoot, we might. So we just don't take her to the top of the castle. We, um... Uh... What do we do? We grab the sword and take the take this exit. We just travel through the through the sewers. Also, I'm assuming Javi is a boy name. So the last developer is male. Yeah, no worries. We can make it to wherever we're going. Actually, we can. Piece of cake. Thank you, princess. Wonderful. You know, it kind of looks like the Mimic has a big ponytail. What are we doing inside a friggin' volcano? We're going places. Chill. It confuses me why the developers blocked off the lava trinket, though. Wait. Wait, they killed the chicken. And now a minion is here. What's going on? Did he eat the chicken? He ate the chicken. And the old man's dialogue is just the same. Wait, wait, but that, that, we wanted the sword. Wait, what, what? Tim and the princess moved to Tim's home. They made a living posting videos of treasure chest unboxings, video game streaming, and yummy recipes. Anyway, that's where I'm quitting today. Thank you for watching, and have a good one.